I am Mexican and I'm Puerto Rican. It kind of builds a little insecurity of, for me. We hate our Africanity. Asians hate themselves so much. That kind of shows you how bad white people can be. Okay, the positive things in the black community. We seem to be a lot of fun. We're very charismatic people. Obviously, I know a lot of white people because I am one. Some of whom are gregarious and, and warm and very charitable. I'm an Eagle Scout, so I knew a lot of good people who were, you know, community service oriented and whatnot. And yeah, oh, okay, oh, these people are great. There are certain elements such as family and I know work ethic that are really identifiable elements to Chicano people, Raza people, Latinos in general. Even for example, coming in today, you know, outside on the streets, you see people of Raza descent and you just see a notion of two things. They're out working right now and they're probably working with their families. Koreans have made a pretty remarkable impact on the world. Like just through technology, their economy, uh, their arts, Korean art and pop culture just wasn't on anyone's radar. And now it's like BTS is performing at the Grammys. Korean cinema is like, Korean mainstream cinema is probably the most developed scene in all of Asia now. We're boisterous, like we enjoy life. Even when things have gone terribly, terribly wrong, we'll still sing and party. You know, we'll get through it. And that's nothing short of miraculous. I'm a Mexican, I love my country. We're very warm people. Um, I think what defines a lot is, is our religion. I mean, everybody's got like, there's a huge Catholic population and I think it defines a lot of things of how we, you know, how, the, how we do things. So I basically fill in Caucasian and that's pretty much all it means to me. Finding a community and a culture to identify with probably came out of my spiritual belief. And that would be being Christian. I have friends who go down to Mexico trying to help them create a system or a farming that is cleaner and a little bit more healthier. I think that those are some of the things that are beautiful and come from the Christian community. I think Nigerian Americans have this very prominent sense of duty and being um, excellent in whatever they choose to do. There's a stat out there that Nigerians are one of the most educated ethnic groups in America. Growing up, like education was the biggest priority. Uh, my parents were like, you are going to a top school. Like that's what's happening. My whole entire family had come over here as uh, refugees from Vietnam War. And my mom is one of 12 kids. My dad is one of eight kids. I have tons of first cousins, aunties and uncles. So us getting together and doing what, you know, the same cultural traditions that they had done as Buddhists, you know, going to temple and praying for our elder or those who have passed. And as I was, got a little bit older, I realized that not a lot of other cultures, especially in America, do that. White people have contributed cheeseburgers. I think, Are, is, did we can make cheeseburgers? Oh or American culture? America, yeah. Okay, I'll give that.